Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy, the main cloud, checking in with another review. And what we're reviewing is some haze, blazing blue. Uh, one of my subscribers, as you know, put me onto it. I picked it up, and uh, like I said in my last vid, I was gonna do the I got it right here, Banana Rama mix. But she wanted to try the Blazing Blue by itself. And I said, all right, fuck it, let's do it. Plus, we just finished eating. Well, I didn't finish eating. My sandwich is right over here. Let me show y'all. Pastrami. Oh, amazing. Mm. Lettuce, tomatoes, um, honey mustard, some onions, some, uh, what else we got? Uh, forgot else what I put it, but I don't like no dry ass salmon, so put some mayonnaise on it. Anyway, I don't. Let me ask you guys this question: Do you guys feel after you finish eating a good ass meal that you just want to spark up a bowl? I feel like that all the time. Like if if I'm out and I have a good ass meal, thirst to come back and fucking spark up a bowl, man. Thirst. So let me know if that that ever happens to you. Anyway, letting you guys know what I'm watching. Uh, March Madness is going down, sports fanatic, and this is one of the best times of the year. Uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, be up all on it. As soon as I get home, I'm watching it. But anyway, let's get into the review. I got the uh, our hookah down there with uh, Paul Leonardo's Alien Bowl, Cloud Lotus, of course. We got the uh, Thunder Dart with the uh, strawberry mouth tip for some restriction because it is uh, an easy draw on uh, our hookah. So let's get into it. Great clouds with haze. Great clouds with the R hookah for me anyway. Um, still didn't forget the, the review. It's, it's, it's coming. Slowly but surely, if there's a review that will come out and I'll finally pop out with the R hookah review. And uh, but anyway, let's get into the taste. Um, it actually tastes, tastes good. I thought it was just gonna taste like a mint. It has like some laser, laser and blue effects with fire. But for whatever reason, the the blazing blue. I don't know if you guys right there. The blazing blue title just was. I was just thinking mint, so I thought he was gonna put me onto like a banana and mint, something like that. But it, it it almost tastes like blueberry and like a sweet a sweet blueberry taste to it, and it tastes good. Um, I'm glad he recommended it. I um. I think it's Knight Rider J Dub, I believe. I'm, I'm probably screwing this shit up, man. Sorry. <laughs> like I said, I, I like I, I just got I just got in the house. I just came off a double and I just got in, got the package, and get into the review just like that. So, but um, I'm glad he gave me the the suggestion, man. Quick review. Um, I suggest you guys pick it up. Uh, for me, the, the flavor is better than the pure blueberry. Um, I give this. I give it a nice, uh, a, a strong eight. I give it a strong eight. Anyway, guys, it's your boy, the main cloud, checking out with another review. Check out Mar March Madness, man, if you guys, um, don't watch sports, man. Just, it's, it's, 
It's good upsets. I'm always for the underdog when it comes to March Madness. Until like the Elite Eight, then I kind of go high, high picks, Duke, Kentucky. I would love to see Duke and Kentucky go at it in uh, the finals, man. That would be amazing. But anyway, checking out. I got to take you guys out with a cloud.